I chose Casnovia because it seemed like a really good fit for me. I really like the size of it. I like, I grew up here. I grew up in Manlius, so I've come to Cas my whole life. I think it's gorgeous here. I always wanted to go to a small liberal arts school and I liked how close it was to home. I heard about Kaz through a family friend who had suggested that we uh, check it out as an option for me to go back to school. I didn't really know where I wanted to go or if I wanted to stay around here. And I looked at the program and really liked it. The art community definitely, you know, recognized me as one of their own and kind of took me in a little bit. Um, made me feel like this was a, like, understanding place, a place that would get me. And that was really nice. One of my first experiences on campus was going into uh, one of my first classes back um, after having not been in college for like four years. And I had a drawing composition with Jen Pepper, which was really intense. <laughs> and I went in there and I was like, what did I get myself into? I can't do this. And I ended up getting an A. I have a philosophy minor and I have a 3D studio art minor. I chose my philosophy minor because I love philosophy. It really um, opens you up to a lot of different ways to look at what you're already studying and it helps you understand everything better. The art program here is amazing. I love taking any studio classes I can get my hands on. This is a way to make a, a cast of something. This is like a five step process that I'm doing because first I have to put this in the clay, then I have to build up the walls, then I have to spray it with release, then I have to make this mold, so then I have just one piece. We had a, a special topics last semester with Sarah, Breaking the Frame, which was a really, really fun class because it was all non-traditional methods of photography presentation. It was literally about like getting rid of the concept of the frame and sometimes getting rid of the frame entirely. And so we did a lot of experimental stuff. So that was really fun. When I um, left Bennington, I got a job back here at Industrial Color Labs. And I started working in photo finishing and editing and retouching and framing and printing and all of that. And I was like, wow, I really, I really like this. I think that I want to do this, you know, for real. And I start, so I started working and I was a freelance photographer for like three years before I came back to school. I think that's when I decided that I wanted to study it. 